focus specifically three areas that will focus your efficiency when working. And I'm using work as kind of that any kind of work framework. Um, if it's work work, if it's household work, if it is creative work, it's all about knowing that there are some systems you need to have in place to do it. And it's kind of the third layer of the streamlined connection. First, I have the mindset where we get our mindset before mechanics, and then we simplify. So you're getting rid of all the eliminating and eliminating the clutter and the things in your way. And the focus is where you really get down to the systems and how does it all come together so you can work efficiently and effectively, right? And it starts with what are you working to create? What is the purpose of your work? Um, not the bigger mission purpose that people talk about, but what specifically are the tasks you're engaged in? What are they helping you create? Um, if it's a creative project, great. If it's income, that's great too. If it's impact or just a nurturing and supportive environment for your family, it's all the same because everything comes down to kind of essential systems, right? And, and I'm going to use business mostly for today's talk since that's what led up to the issue today <laughs> was business systems. But there's a couple ways of looking at it. I frame everything I do around work into five essential business systems. There is um, marketing and money and people and inventory and deliverables. They loosely translate into household systems as well, which I'll talk about on another day. But everything I do to run my business is goes into one of those five buckets. And so um, I know how to focus my, my days. Each day gets a bucket. Well, kind of. <laughs> I don't have a whole lot of inventory as a service-based business, but I do have some inventory. So I usually use that day as a lot of writing and learning as well. So um, because marketing just has everything as marketing, really. How I make the money, how I use the money, who I use the money on and with, all of it ties back to marketing in a big way. So any extra time left over on the days that I focused on one of the other areas goes into marketing. But what if it's just in your house or in your creative endeavor? You still have to market. You have to talk to people about what it is you do. You may not be for ultimate sales, but it is for buy-in or impact. And so marketing is very important. And often there's some tech things that go along with it. So there's that. Um, but everybody hates marketing. Everybody. I, I'm pretty sure even marketers who claim to be fascinated by the process like one aspect of marketing, not all the different aspects of marketing. So know that it's a little bit of the chore piece of the puzzle. Um, the fun stuff comes from the delivery and the talking to people and making the money, right? <laughs> um, I will say though, that when I work with businesses, small businesses, especially marketing and money are two of the systems that they put off putting in place right away. They want to do the fun stuff first and they will get around to the rest of it. And that can lead to other issues. So think about it um, from the what's the least amount of work I can do to get the biggest bang for my buck. It's usually picking up the phone or writing an email to um, touch base with the people you're trying to get tire you, right? But all of it, there's branding, there's design, there's font choice, there's messaging. All of that is part of marketing. And you can create really easy systems to help you leverage the time you spend on it and make it easier so that you stay consistent in your marketing message and the way you describe what you do to people. So the people referring to you are not confused. I may or may not have suffered and continue to suffer occasionally from that problem, being unclear in what it is I do. So that's part of why I'm also doing these videos so that you can um, begin to understand more about the streamlined connection and how all the pieces come together so you can have a more efficient and effective life, work, and fun. Um, mindset, simplify, focus. It's one after the other, the steps that lead you to delightful days. All right. Um, I hope that brings a little bit of clarity. Sorry for the confusion today and the issues. I like to be transparent when it's like totally on me. I fumbled the ball on this one and we'll learn 
more better approach to how to do these these lives um every monday but also i want to give you a heads up we're probably changing the time to um morning or noon eastern time and and 10 a.m mountain time just because i don't know this 1 p.m time frame for me seems to get in the way of a couple other things i'm doing so i'm feeling a little frazzled when i do these and i'd rather have a little space and margin around it so you get a better result okay anyway look for that change coming up next week and um in the meantime don't forget to tell all your friends like follow share and um i will talk to you next week have a delightful day <laughs>